It is your turn. It is your no. Go. Gary Anderson was able to keep the Badger machine going after Brett Bielema bolted for Arkansas, and now it's up to Paul Chris to put the program back in the Big Ten title chase. Here's the deal with the 2015 Wisconsin Badgers. The pieces are all in place to be excellent again, and don't expect any major changes under the new coaching staff. Corey Clement will be the main man for the ground game now with Melvin Gordon gone, but the line might need a little while to come together. The receivers are experienced, they just aren't very good, and quarterback Joel Stave has to have more to his game than just experience. Defensively, the line should be outstanding, and the secondary is going to be among the best in the Big Ten with cornerback Sojourn Shelton and all four starters returning. But how much pressure is going to be on Chris right away? Wisconsin has come up with at least three 11 win seasons in the last five years, and unlike most new head coaches, he's not going to get any sort of a grace period. Part of the reason is because the team is strong, and the other reason is because of the schedule. Now, the last thing a team with a reworked offensive line needs is to start the year with Alabama, but after that, it's kind of smooth sailing. The Nebraska is the one big showdown, and that's on the road, but that's really it. There's no Ohio State or Michigan State from the East, and facing Maryland and Rutgers instead, that's not that bad. So, while 10 wins might be more realistic, expect the Badgers to pull off an 11 win season in Chris's first year at the helm. I'm Pete Futak. To dive deeper into the 2015 Badgers, check out the written preview on Campus Insiders.